What were the lion-faced men in Scripture? And of the Gadites, there separated themselves unto David, into the hold, to the wilderness, men of might, and men of war fit for the battle, that could handle shield and buckler, whose faces were like the faces of lions, and were as swift as the rose upon the mountains. Men with the faces of lions gave themselves in military service to King David. Not only did David's man Benaiah kill a seven-foot, six-inch-tall Egyptian with the Egyptian's own spear, the scripture also tells us that he slew two lion-like men. And Benaiah, the son of Jehoiada, the son of a valiant man of Kabzeel, who had done many acts, he slew two lion-like men of Moab. He went down also and slew a lion in the midst of a pit in time of snow. Scripture about these lion-faced men is confirmed by an ancient Egyptian text called The Craft of the Scribe. The face of the pass is dangerous, with Sashu hidden under the bushes. Some of them are four or five cubits, nose to foot, with wild faces. This ancient Egyptian text dates to 1250 BC, only 200 years before King David and Scripture's account of the lion-faced men. The Egyptian gods were theriantropic, human-animal hybrids. Sekhmet, Anubis, Sobek. Why were the Egyptian, Hindu, Greek, and Babylonian deities depicted as chimeras? Were they truly hybrids? Might there be more truth to our mythologies than most like to admit? Scripture tells us that the antediluvian animals had become corrupted. And God looked upon the earth, and behold, it was corrupt, for all flesh had corrupted his way upon the earth. In Genesis chapter 6, verse 7, it repented God that he had made the animals. The book of Enoch tells us that the Nephilim sinned against the animals. And they began to sin against birds and beasts and reptiles and fish and to devour one another's flesh and drink the blood. Were the Nephilim, the children of the Watchers, mixing the DNA of Elohim's creation? Scripture tells us that every creature ate plants at creation. And to every beast of the earth, and to every fowl of the air, and to everything that creepeth upon the earth, wherein there is life, I have given every green herb for meat, and it was so. How do sharks and Tyrannosaurus rex fit in? Did the Nephilim further corrupt Elohim's perfect creation by breeding carnivores? In Revelation, the Antichrist has the power to breathe life into the image of the beast. And he had power to give life unto the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should both speak and cause that as many as would not worship the image of the beast should be killed. Is the image of Solus Chimera bred by the Antichrist? Why did the United States Senate pass the Endless Frontiers Act of 2021 to allow the bioengineering of human-animal hybrid species? But as the days of Noah were, so shall also the coming of the Son of Man be. The Book of Enoch, chapter 1, verses 1 and 2, say that only the generation of the Great Tribulation will understand the contents of the book. Be ready for the return of Christ and know the signs of the times. <laughs>